Praise the Lord. Good morning. How are you doing? It's a brand new day. Yeah. Praise you, the Lord. Super grateful to be alive again. You know, that means that God's got great things in store for you. So cheer up. Yeah. Be happy and smile and thank the Lord. You know, do a lot of thanksgiving. Yes, there's a lot of blessing in there. So be happy and celebrate. God's got you. Yeah. I know that for sure. So, Open Heavens for today is titled, God as Favorite. God as Favorite. Hallelujah. You know, when I saw this topic, I was so excited. And then I was thinking to myself, God, please, I hope I'm one of your favorites. Like, I really love to be that. Yes. So, let's go into it. Praise the Lord. Our memory verse is taken from Romans chapter 9, verse 13. It says, As it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. Our Bible reading for today is from Romans 9, verse 10 to 16. And not only this, but when Rebekah also had conceived by one, even by her father Isaac, for the children being not yet born, Neither having done any good or evil, that the purpose of God according that the purpose of God according to election might stand, not of works, but of him that call it. It was said unto her, The elder shall serve the younger, as it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. What shall we say then? Is there unrighteousness with God? God forbid. For he said to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy, and I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. So then it is not of him that will it, nor of him that run it, but of God that show it mercy. Hallelujah. Our message reads, when you look at the apostles of the Lord, you will see that there were 12 of them, but there were three in the inner circle, and there was one who was called the Beloved. These three were the favorites of Jesus Christ, and he took them with him everywhere he went. When he was going to Jairus' house, he had all the twelve disciples with him, but it was only those three who he took with him. Mark chapter 5, verse 35 to 42. Peter, James, and John saw his power. They saw him raise the little girl from death, while the others only heard about it. Why did the Lord have a special inner circle amongst his disciples? And why did he love one of them specially? Well, the simple answer is that God has favorite. Many people say that God has no favorite. That is not true. The question you should be asking, therefore, is how do I become one of his favorites? Yeah, how do I become one? I really love to be. When you read Romans 9, 11 to 16, the Bible says, A woman was pregnant with a set of twins. Before they were born, God said the elder would save the younger, that he loved one and hated the other, even when they were not yet born. He said they will have mercy on whom he will have mercy, and compassion on whom he will have compassion. He said it is not of him that will it, or of him that run it, but of the Lord who had showed mercy. In Acts 10, verse 34 to 35, the Bible says, Then Peter opened his mouth and said, Of a truth, I perceive that God is no respecter of persons, but in every nation, he that feareth him and walketh righteous is accepted with him. Wow. This passage this passage makes me see clearly that God looks out for certain things in people before he makes them his favorite. I took a close look at Peter, James, and John, his three favorite disciples. I studied Peter and John especially because it wasn't long after Jesus' ascension that James was killed. I will share what I learned from these two with you in the next two days. Wow, I really can't wait. Yeah. I bet you can't wait also. I would love to know because I would really love to be one of God's favorite. Praise the Lord. I pray that we are all counted um, worthy <laughs> by God's grace, you know, by his grace and by his mercy to be his favorite. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Because I know that there are so many blessings attached to that. And then to always have access to God. That's such a great privilege I would love to have. So God, please... Amen. Okay, so we look forward to next two days to know what actually those things are, are that our daddy learned. Praise the Lord. Um, so our prayer point for today says, Father, even if we only pick one person as your favorite, please let it be me. Say, Father, even if you will only pick one person as your favorite, please let it be me. Pray. 
Praise the Lord. Our aim for today is in Alsa CJ aim 6. I am so glad our Father in heaven. I am so glad our Father in heaven tells us his love in the book he has given. Wonderful things in the Bible I say. This is the dearest that Jesus loves me. Refrain. I'm so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. I am so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves even me. Yes, Jesus loves even me. Praise the Lord. Our Bible in one year reading according to open heavens is first timothy 1 to 6 once first timothy chapter 1 to 6 so please follow up with that even as we round up the year god bless you god favor you because god cast his face to shine upon you today is blessed of you for you and all yours in jesus name the lord sends his guide it guides you daily sends his help to you consistently a series of help comes unto you in the name of jesus and you by the renewing of your mind in christ jesus by the renewing of our minds in christ jesus will come god's favorite in the name of jesus Praise the Lord. All right. See you tomorrow. By God's grace, please have a beautiful and amazing day. Bye.